welcome back to my channel at home with Sheila on today's episode I get to be bringing you guys a huge shopping haul for Easter and a little bit of spring in there mixed in as well because I'm gonna be using these items to decorate a few little places in my home and I want to get them out get them shown so you can see a sneak peek what's up to come on a few more episodes on my channel already with that sit back and relax and let me show you which what I've got oh and before I do Go ahead and hit that subscribe button. I would love to have you and be honored to have you in my little YouTube family. Okay? All right, let me get situated and I'll be right back. All right, on my first item, let me bring it to you guys, is these cute little figurines that spell out Easter. Um, they are a white ceramic um, little figurine, little Easter bunnies, and they spell out Easter. I'm sorry for the glare. I know that's, I hope you guys can see it better now. And I got this at Home Goods, and I paid twelve ninety nine for it. And I really thought these were really cute. Like that way, I could space them. And I love how each one of them are facing, you know, each other in the little groups. And um, even the letters are still straight, but they're facing. I thought that was really unique, and I loved how that looked. And uh, these are. I'm so sorry for the glare. There you go. But these would be sitting perfect you know, on your TV stand or any kind of little. Um, a media cabinet you may have or anything like that. I thought this would be really cute. Alrighty. Next, I found this same Easter Bunny kind of thing here. This. I thought this was adorable. I mean, look at this. It's huge, first of all. And it's ceramic. Got it at Home Goods. Um, but it came with all three of these um, baking utensils. It's got a wooden spoon, a rubber spatula, you know, for like scraping out your batter or whatever. And and this here, now this one here feels a little a little flimsy uh, for a whisk, but I may not even use, I may just kind of take off this paper and just kind of set them in there, kind of stage them in there. But no matter, I thought they really, really look cute together. And I love how the spatula matched the pink and uh, white gingham here on there. Look at the Easter Bunny. I thought this was, they actually had like a whole um, set of this kind of like look like this. I really thought these were adorable. But the, uh, this here was um, $14.99. I'm not sure if you guys can see that. but And at first I kind of debated on it because I thought $14.99, hmm, I'm not sure. But but no matter, um, I still love the way it looked, especially with the Easter Bunny on there. And these three little baking utensils, I mean, great. I mean, I really did like that. Okay, next up, I really, really love gnomes. Um, some of them are a little, mm, a little freaky looking, <laughs> but some of them are really cute, especially like for like the Christmas ones or, you know, there's certain ones that kind of decorate them up for the different holidays. That's the ones I really am attracted to, but I found these here. I got these here, of course, at Home Goods. but look at them. Aren't they adorable? Look, um, they're different sizes. One's a little bit taller than the other. And this one here is holding like a pink egg. And this one here has got a blue egg. I love the way these look. And they are like a, some kind of like a ceramic-like plastic. But, I mean, look at them. They're, they're really, really nice. Look at their hats. Each one of them has got like a, this one here has got a, a, what's a butterfly on it. This one has like a flower. They're so cute. Look at this. I was probably going to sit them around, you know, wherever my little area, the majority of my little Easter area is going to be like a table over there um, and I, in my dining room slash living room. And I'm going to put them there because they're itching to go there. It's a perfect little spot. But look at them and look at the little noses. <laughs> All right. Uh, now, these here were probably my favorite item. Favorite item. Next, I am, you know, I'm looking for, like I said, mostly you know, Easter stuff. And, but for some reason, there's not a lot of orange decor out there. I know right now it's yellow, 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 which I love yellow. And I, my whole kitchen right now got really, you know, a lot of yellow in it. But I couldn't find a lot of orange, uh, especially for Easter. And I looked around a bunch of places, but I did find some because I really wanted some orange. But I found a couple items. One is this adorable little bitty um, carrot like it's a mug. Look at it. <laughs> and even here, I don't know if you can see it, it says carrot on the little tag. It's made into it. I mean, look how 
adorable the way that it's made. Of course, I probably won't use it. I'll probably just sit it out there and maybe put like some greenery or something in it. But look at this. That is so cute. I love um, the girl the green is right there. It looks like, like, you know, the top of the carrot been like kind of cut. And especially this right here. And the, the, that right there is like, that what made it here when they put the little tag on it. Um, this here was a three ninety nine. dollars Got it on goods. Next up are these cute little bowls. Look how cute these are. Um, what I really liked about them was the fact they were orange on the inside of them. Um, actually, both, yeah, both of them are. They're both inside orange, and one here had little carrots all over it, and it's got like a orange and white polka dot at the bottom. And these, oh, they're so cute. Let me, I hope you guys can see it. These were so cute. When I saw these, I thought these would be great because I may kind of like stack them on top of each other. What I do is um, I'll go to like Dollar Tree or whatever, especially my Ray Dunn, like bowls and things like that. I'll buy those little plastic, little cheap little, they look like little bitty round little bowls. I'm not sure what they're called, but I'll put them on top of each other. So when I put the next one in, it kind of gives it height. That way I can kind of like stack them up so you can see what each one of them says. But that's what I probably want to do to these because they got them in different sizes. But I really like this here. Oh, I'm not sure. I'm sorry. Uh, I pay $4.99 at Good Home Goods for this here. Then I come across this other set of bowls I really like. And they went like this. And they're actually the um, orange and white stripe with the carrot. Where the other one, the little small one, had a little orange and white polka dot. Love it. And there's actually a set of three to this here set. Um, all of them got the orange on the inside. And the way it looks, I'm not opening them up yet. I believe all three of them are like this. I mean, look how cute these are. Especially, like I said, to kind of stack them up. Put, or just kind of like put them single file and, and put a little greenery in it or put candy in it. What You know, whatever you want to do, but love them. And these were $9.99. At, at first, I was like, hmm, but then again, for three, I mean, that's not too bad. So, but you know how cute these are. I, can't, I cannot wait to get these out. Love them. Now, the set really came complete when I found this bowl. And as you see, it's a bigger version of this one here, these here that sit. Um, and you got the carrot on the inside. And this one don't have, it's not like orange. This one is orange like these are. But, you know, I really, really loved how this looked sitting out together. Now, funny story about this bowl here. Um, this wasn't the real bowl that I got. Um, the actual one I originally got was quite bigger. It was, um, I would say about, I don't know, maybe half a size bigger than this one um and i got it i mean you know, i went to home goods and i got them all and i really liked how big that bowl was i come home i got my items out of the car which which home goods always wraps their items so good they put a, a tape on it they'll put three four or ten pieces of that white kind of craft paper they use really love the way they do that so like secure from traveling or whatever especially when you go you buy it and you take it home and the time you get out of the car, you know, things can happen. Well, they wrap, you know, I don't, well, hopefully they wrapped it good because when I got it out of the car, I got my bag up and all of a sudden I hear crash. Guess what was in that bag? That other one, the bigger bowl that I was telling you about. It, the bag, the side of the bag kind of ripped and it went crashing in my driveway. I was devastated. And I'm like, are you kidding me? And actually, this set of bowls here was sitting inside of that one. And I can't believe this one did not bust too because this one here just went to a billion pieces. But like I said, it was sitting in there and this one did not, I, there's no chips or cracks or nothing. Because I th first thought this was, you know, part of the crashing that I heard, but it wasn't. So um, I wanted the set so bad, especially with that. So I called up and um, I, Called him up as soon as I went in the house. I called him up and asked if they had one because they hold it because I was going to put my stuff out. I was going to go back because I'm one of those type when I see something I want, 
I, I want it. So uh, when I called and spoke to the manager, she said that they didn't have any more because I did not think I didn't see any when I did buy that bigger, that other bowl. But I was hoping maybe, you know, but yeah, they couldn't. So um, the following few days later, I've been thinking about it, thinking about this bowl. And uh, I actually went to another nearby town looking to see if that Home Goods had this bowl. And my sister, uh, you know, she was trying to help me. I mean, I love her to death. She actually is the one who found this one, which is a smaller one. I guess it's the medium size one, maybe. And, uh, but I was so happy that she did find it for me, even though it wasn't the big one, but I didn't care. I was happy with this one. So <laughs> when I bought a few other things, so on our way home, I was like, I almost want to set this thing in my lap. I don't want to do, you know, do anything happen to it, but but anyway, sorry that story got long, uh, lengthy there, but I just thought that was a cute little story. But but anyway, through, through my sister, she helped me find this one here. So I got my set. All right, now to match up with the orange and the carrots and everything, I found this. Is that not cute? Um, I, I just bought this, like, kind of like this to sit it out beside of this little set because I've got an idea of what it's going to look like with these bowls here, and um, once I stack them and stage them and everything, it's gonna look real good. And, um, but when I saw this, I thought, oh, how cute. It's kind of like a little bitty um, novelty little thing. I paid, it was four, uh, yeah, four ninety nine. dollars sorry, let me see that. Four ninety nine dollars for this, um, which is mm, a little pricey for something, you know, like this, but I figured two ninety nine, three ninety nine. dollars but I figured it really would match the carrots with this. Like I said, I've got a, my idea what it's gonna look like. I knew I needed a little something, and when I saw this, I thought, mm -hmm, perfect. Now, I was looking around some more, um, and like I told you, I couldn't find anything orange and white except for that, and I thought, okay, I'll go with this, and I'll run with it. I'll, I'll make it do, and maybe something else will kind of, you know, some other store I may find something orange, and I did find something orange, adorable. And at that same home goods that, well, my sister and I were looking for the other bowl, I found this. <laughs> Isn't this cute? <laughs> I loved it. Um, it was $7.99. Now, that to me was worth $7.99. Um, it is it's like a little container, ceramic. I probably won't put anything in it. I probably just kind of set it out. But that really, really made my set when I saw this. I thought, okay. I knew I needed something else, but like something with height. And I, this, when I saw this, I thought, okay, now I have no idea what I was going to have on my table. And this here made it complete. I mean, look how cute this is, especially for $7.99. I mean, the way I'm thinking, they did have like a set of all these orange and white striped things. But the way it goes, I mean, I started buying some of this stuff in January. And um, so you think, why well, they get Easter stuff out in January, and now you go, there's hardly anything left. So if you don't start buying it, and then when you try it, is it the holiday getting near? <laughs> Everything's already picked over, and you know, so you're out of luck. But now I got my orange and white little set, and I know I'm able to perfect way it's gonna come out. All right, next what I'm gonna show you. I usually don't buy things like this because I really don't know where to put it, and um is and also i didn't know if i want to you know have run the risk of breaking it but when i saw it i just couldn't pass it up they are actually two of these beautiful wine glasses look at the bunnies aren't they cute and they're orange so you know i thought my set might be complete with this but i may may not put these in it because i mean look how adorable these are these were three ninety nine each. Now I see three ninety nine of these because these say hand painted. I'm like, whoa. But anyway, um, hand painted, hand wash only. So I thought, whoa. But they are so cute. And um, I, they only had two. And I thought, oh well. I kind of carried my buggy for a little bit. And I thought, well. And I thought, yeah, I'll go ahead and get them. Because especially when I saw. <laughs> <laughs> Look at this. Is this not pretty? 
I am in love with this. Um, I thought, okay, I'll take the two wine glasses. It's two, well, there's only four. I'll take the two because I found this to match it. Um, this was $12.99. And this has actually got some weight to it. You know, it's, it's kind of heavy. But look how beautiful. And just think, to you know, sit, this sitting out, you know. You know what? I could put, like, put something, like, give it height, you know, a little bit higher and put these kind of in front of it, that, you know, to show off these, the bunnies. That would look really cute. Like maybe like a, or put them in a basket, you know, put this with maybe like a little orange tea towel, if I can find any. And these here, um, that would be really cute sitting around maybe on a vignette, some, you know, a vignette area on your kitchen table, on your countertops, you know, somewhere you don't want it to bust or anything like that. But I, that, that might look cute together. Like, can I put it up something on a pedestal and then have these in front of it? Because they actually had like the little small wine glasses, you know, like the little, gosh, what's the name of them? The little small ones. Um, oh dear. Anyway, the, the small ones that look like this. Oh, stainless, sorry. The stainless ones. And so just this, but they only, um, they only had three of them. And one of them was cracked. And the other one, it was like something was missing here, so I didn't get them. But now I would have got those instead of these. Um, but but like I said, they was kind of messed up. So um, I was hoping, you know, they would discount them, but, you know, they wouldn't. But that's okay. It's all right. But look how cute. So I'm so excited on how three, all three of these things look together. They're going to be cute. All right. Now... A little bit more items, but I come across this thing here. Look at him. <laughs> Look, I mean, he's actually like a, I guess like a, a little creamer. Um, yeah, because he pours out of his little mouth here. But look how cute he is. He's gray and white ceramic. And like I said, his little mouth is open, as you can see where my finger puts in there. Where you would like put milk in there or whatever. Um, little creamer, liquid creamer. Um, but look how cute he would uh, be sitting around uh, with a few other little items. But now they did have a few other items. Sorry, they are. They did have like a bigger, like a cookie jar that kind of looked like this one here. Um, I guess it was a set or something. But like I said, when I was looking around, it's like they had a piece of this and a piece of that. Things are already getting picked over a lot. But look how cute this is. Anyway, but I really like this. And this here was. Nine nine nine. Look how cute. Oh, sorry. Nine nine nine. How cute. All righty. Now, all righty. For those of you guys who know me personally, know that I've been starting to collect some Ray Dunn. You know, not a huge collector, but just certain little pieces I've been collecting, and um, and looking for something either Easter or spring, and you know that they're almost hard, so hard to find, especially certain little things, but I found these. I love them. Look at them. This one here says, good morning, and this one here says, let's eat. And they're pink, and this one's blue. Look how pretty these are. I'm going to, again, it, all of my radar, I kind of stack them up, like put that little piece I was telling you about, little clear plastic little cuppy thing. I put them in there, so that kind of, that way you can show off you know what they say. I found these two, and then I found uh, Devour. Now this isn't the Easter uh, spring here, but this, it's okay, no matter. They're the same size and everything. And these were $5.99. Hope you guys can see that. Yeah. $5.99 for these. And like I said, I'm gonna kind of stagger them um, and you know, that way all three of the names show out. I think that's what most people do. Um, but I was like, I love those, especially I finally found some of the Easter. I'm oh, like, goodness, and I oh, they came from Home Goods. And another thing Ray done that I found are these glasses. Uh, I guess they're the, the, um, the stemless wine glasses. Um, they are their, I guess, her uh, party or line or whatever. Um, this one says enjoy. It says five. Let's see, five p.m. I like that. Um, this is party and then fun. Look how cute. 
and these were $9.99. I mean, that's pretty good. If you can see that, $9.99. Again, at Home Goods. Um, really, really like these. Now, I may not put these out um, to use. I may just kind of um, put them in my cab. Well, soon to be put them in my cabinet because I'm going to be getting me a little, little cabinet. I don't want nothing too big. Um, but putting them in my dining room so I can put some of my Ray Dunn items in, which my husband thinks I don't need any more um, little furniture, but yeah. <laughs> but uh, I'm going to get me like a, like a little bitty one, not a huge one, because like I said, I'm not a huge collector. I just like, you know, certain ones, which is actually accumulating to be a, a little bit of stuff, but anyway. Okay, <laughs> all right, like I said, these were uh, $9.99. I got these at Home Goods. All righty, next, I got a couple of baskets. Um, this one here, this one was $4.99. I mean, Home Goods, they've got it going on in their baskets, and they're not, they're always so reasonable. I mean, look at these, and I love these, the, um, the metal kind of um, holders they got here, little handles. I mean, look at this. But at first, I was going to put, well, it's over there. Uh, at first, I had it where I was going to put the, the glass um, pitcher and then two wine glasses. I was going to put it with here like a cute little, um, maybe like a Easter thing towel, you know, kind of like put it in there. But I may, I may not, but I really like it. It's also, it is kind of flat. But I don't want it, you know, I don't want my items to be rocking. So that's what I'm thinking. Maybe if I put something down, then maybe like um, uh, some styrofoam to kind of give it some, you know, keep it flat. I'm not sure. So I'll play around with it, or, you know, and go from there. Next is this other basket I got. Again, Home Goods, um, $6.99 for it because I guess it's got a handle. And look at it, it's got like, um, three little spots, a uh, slot, sorry, and then uh, also this big slot here. I guess you can put like spoon, fork, knives, and then your napkins. I think that's what maybe it would be used for. I may use that, I may not, because I kind of like using little baskets for other things, greenery, um, little, you know, little things of candy, you know, or uh, maybe some napkins, you know, um, some linens, you know, things like that. And, and um, but I'll, I'll figure something out as always, but look how cute. I love the coloring. Look at it. And like I said, it was $6.99. I mean, I mean, really, they're baskets. I mean, they got it going on in their baskets. Alrighty. Just a few more things. <laughs> like I said, I've been accumulating this stuff for, you know, a, a couple uh, months now. Now, I got some, I've been eyeballing their um, dishware, um, especially I'm looking for something for like a tablescape. And when I finally decided that's what I like, cause I've been bouncing around looking at other stores. I really like the one at Home Goods. Um, this was one pattern here. I love this pattern here, but I got this for, I guess, for the appetizer plate or salad plate maybe. Yeah, it's probably the salad plate. I love this pattern with this this color this gray um it's like a light gray you can see it i love to have this look together i really i mean it i mean believe it or not it really complements each other um it probably don't show up those you know together but it does but unfortunately they only had two of these so i went ahead and bought these two because i thought maybe uh, eventually that i'll find two more or if I keep going to the other home goods in my other um, town that, you know, two may pop up. So I went ahead and bought them, but so far I've not come across none of them. And so I thought, well, you know, I can always take it back, but, or I may just keep them and kind of like maybe, you know, I can always kind of put one like, like a, um, a little, uh, little stands, you know, like to set them up and maybe put like like something kind of sitting in front of it or something for like accent but who knows well, who knows i may still find them i don't know but i do know i thought pier one on their advertisement they had um something like this but when i went and looked at it there it, the pattern was a little different but i could probably still you know play around with it probably still would blend but i'm not sure so 
um, with that, I thought, you know what? I better find something just in case. And I did. I found the pink. The pink and white um, eye gingham pattern. Look at it. it? Now, this one here really goes with this. Look at this. I love the way this looks. And I may get like a, um, there's a, there's, I may get a smaller, that would be the appetizer plate. Like a little small or a saucer plate, put it here um, to maybe compliment maybe the, the Easter bunny or something or, or maybe the carrot, because I did see a couple of them. But I love the way this looks. Now, the only thing left to get in my, you know, of my um, tablescape would be some kind of a charger of some sort. I've been looking on Amazon and other places, but haven't found the one I like, but really QVC had some, and I really like so I may order them through there. I'm not sure, but I'll keep looking um, to see, because I hate to buy something I don't know what it looks like in person. It's on TV, but... Anyway, so what you guys think? Is that going to be cute? Now, oh yeah, I got to find some. I do have some um, napkins. I'm going the accents both of that. I'm not going to show it right now, but so it it, it will go with this. So I need to find. So whatever plate I do find, um, I got to keep in mind what my linen's going to look like. Alrighty, there is a sneak peek, by the way, of what my table skirt's going to look like. Okay, next. I found these adorable napkins. Look at these. Um, I'm not sure if they match um, that pattern I just showed you, because like I said, I already got some kind of uh, napkin uh, linens in a, you know, in, in my linen cabinet. But I really, I, when I saw these at Home Goods, six ninety nine. I mean, that's good buy. I mean, look, I mean, look how cute they are. They got a carrot um, and like a little bunny. I'm not sure if you guys can see that. It's got like a bunny, and um, it's like a navy blue or black stripe. I'm not real sure because it's one of them, you know, I haven't really took about the pack, but I think it's like a black. But this Ellen DeGeneres, I mean, I like I said before in my previous video, I did not know she had any home decor. I'm shocked, and her items are really cute. They really are, but like I said, there's four of them, 19 by 19 inch, uh, so that's a good size. For $6.99, pretty good. And am I the only one thinking that there is no such thing as orange napkins out there? I cannot find any. Um, I've been looking for some, like I said, to, you know, because I, I do two. I go do one napkin, then do another one, then put my whatever little ring, um, kind of like it, give it more contrasting, you know, colors. But I've been looking around for orange table napkins, and I can't find them. So I did find these, though. Um, I went to World Market. These are their, um, I think it's, yeah, it's actually, yeah, there's a 20 by 20. It's a little bit bigger. Um, and they were $9.99, and actually it's six of them that comes in this set. So, but I thought, well, you know, that's okay. Um, you know, if I decide to go this here or my other one, I wanted like a more of a brighter orange, like the, the orange I've been showing you, but I cannot find them nowhere. So I went ahead and got these for backup just in case I can't find any. But like I said, for $9.99 for six of them, good. That's pretty good. Then I found this. Look how cute this is. And I'm not a cutesy, cutesy, cutesy person. Um, you know, nothing wrong with the people who are. I mean, honestly, it's not. I, you know, but I didn't want, I'm just not in my, in my decor. I'm not like a, like I said, a cutesy, cutesy. But this here was still cute, but still a little bit, um, a little bit, got a little elegant flair to it. And I, I love, I know you guys can't see it. I'm going to put it up there. But I'm telling you, it looks like little bitty feet, little, little feet prints uh, all over um, the, you know, the background here. And it's gray. And, and I, when I saw this, it's that little feet prints, like little bunny feet. It looks so cute. But look at it. I love the color of the orange carrot here. And the little bunny face here, but look how cute! And I, oh, look at the bottom. I love this little detail here. And this here was six ninety nine um, for two of them, and they're twenty by twenty eight. But like this one here is the only one of the set that has the little um, decorate, you know, the little carrot and everything. Because the other one is just plain on the front and back. But you know, no matter, that's okay. Now this here, I may. Um, Maybe if I could have picked it up, maybe kind of throw it in, you know, the other basket, kind of let it cascade a little bit, and to put my 
glass container on my wine glass. And I may do that. Um, but now that would really look cute together. Sorry, I can't reach it. I would show you what, what I'm trying to say, but you get the gist of it. Kind of like lay it out. May not, maybe use the other one. Not real sure. But now I like this here. Okay, we're coming to an end, I promise. I know this is lengthy. Told you it was a big haul. Alrighty, now, I, I, don't ask me why I bought this. It is not even re related to Easter, but I got these salt and pepper shakers. And you're thinking, Sheila, what, why do you want, I mean, okay, what's the big deal about salt and pepper shakers? Well, look at them. They're like little old fashioned knobs. Look at these. You know, I hope you guys can see it. Look how cute. I mean, I've, I've, I've never seen any like that before. And actually, my sister is the one um, that found these. And she was like, Sheila, look at this. And I, and I looked down and I thought, that's unique. I like that. But they were, now they were $12.99, but they're the grinders, you know. So they're always a little bit more. I was looking more for the shaker. And I'm still, still buying, you know, will find me some. But, but for now, you know, these are cute. And I'm, I just love the way they look, especially with that. I, like I said, I hope you guys can see it. I mean, it looks adorable. But yeah, twelve ninety nine Home Goods. Alrighty. Now, the last few items, um, I've been looking for some floral um, pieces. And I bought these florals, believe it or not, in the, fir like the first of January at Hobby Lobby. Because I've been going back and forth because I'm a Hobby Lobby junkie just as much as I love Home Goods, TJ Maxx, you name it. Um, but there are, there's none left. And like I said, I bought these in January. And I remember looking out a few weeks ago, there was like nothing left for their Easter. Um, well, they may bring some more out. I don't know. But I got a set of these. Look how cute. Um, they're like, uh, they got little Easter eggs in them. Here. Got some greenery. And they're really, they're pretty tall. Got little yellow flowers or pink flowers. And they got these little bitty, look at little, mm, little balls, little glitter balls. I don't think they're eggs, but look how cute they are. And I got two of them. These were $13.99. But before you go, me, I did too. They were 50% off. I never buy anything at Hobby Lobby without 50% off. I mean, because I know the following week they'll have it. All right, like I said, yep, they were $13.99. Maybe you can see that. And I got two of them. And for, ac for accents, I got two of these here. And they're just, they're just pink with, um, there's no greeny whatsoever, but you know, but they, I love the Easter eggs. Like I said, I'm gonna put it, you know, with this here. These were, I'm sorry, this, uh, this was only $6.99, 50% off. So about three, what, three fifty a piece, something like that. And then I got these here. I got I got two of those, by the way. And I got two of these. These were five ninety nine. And these suckers are a little bit heavy. I mean, they were not fifty percent off, so I'm gonna pay three bucks for them. But I'm like, spread them out, you know, and I'll play with it because, you know, flowers not meant to be straight up or just so. They're meant to be kind of like spread out and kind of wispy and. And everything but I love these so what I'm going to be doing is something like this here like in a, in a floral vase um, you know I would love to find me a big huge bunny uh, as a like and use it as a base you know like where his like top of his head will be open or something I'm looking for something like that so I could put my flowers in that would be really really cute don't you think but look how cute I love it but I got now like I said I actually got I just showed you one of each of them but um I've got two of each of these but I would really really wish um I would have got two more of these right here because um, I love the way these look. Because I can just use these in like one little container. I mean, they would they would suffice. But I mean, I love the way these look. But anyway, there's that. And before, and another thing, you guys are going to love these. I got these here at TJ Maxx. 
look at these. <laughs> they're carrots, and like I said, they're on a stem, so you can kind of bend them and, you know, snip them off if you want to. They just kind of like, came with this like green raffia, kind of like kept them together. Um, these were $7.99 at TJ Maxx. Little pricey, but I just thought they were just adorable. And I like how they're unique, like every one of them, like this here, and I know it don't look like it, but it's bent, and it's bent, it's made to be bent. It's like I couldn't straighten it up, you know. But each one of them are, are a little different. But I've actually got three of them, because um, I went back, because I got this great idea of kind of like making a swag with them. You know what I'm saying? Like, make a, like a for the front door, kind of like, of course I'll play with it. Kind of like your short, long, 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 like something like this here. Would that not be cute on the front door with a big, like a big Easter bowl, like a nine or 12 loop bowl? That would be adorable. But look at that. I, got, I can already about imagine. Because when I took it out of the bag, I kind of pulled it up like this. And I thought, hmm, kind of like that. <laughs> but just pulling out the bag and it kind of made it look like it was like a, um, you know, like a swag. But look. Anyway, I got three of those. Three of those. Alrighty. One last thing and I'll be done. The last item in this huge shopping haul, I feel like I've been talking forever and I hope I've not been boring you guys, is this big floral ball. Look how big this thing is. And believe it or not, these are probably one of the most easiest and cheapest thing to put in home decor. Um, I use them like the smaller ones. I'll put them on top of a candlestick, like just like say a candlestick, set them up there. I'll just sit them on uh, a table somewhere. I'll lay a little napkin out and just lay it on top. You'll be surprised what you could do with these garden balls or floral balls. Some people call them floral balls. I call them garden balls. You know, it just, whatever strikes me, I'll call it. <laughs> But anyway, look, look, but I've never seen one this big. Yeah, I have, but not this cheap. And I can't believe it because, I mean, I, I've seen some, one of these at um, Hobby Lobby, I think, and I think it was like 20 bucks. This is only $7.99. I'm thinking to myself, and I was looking around for another one because, I mean, I would have bought another one of these, but look how pretty it is. I love how bright and green it is. Now, like I said, I may not, I don't think I got a candlestick big enough to put it on this one. Now, I may set that out on my little orange and white little vignette I'm going to have, you know, my orange and white decor stuff. I may just sit that as part of the, because the orange and the um, green of this, this green would pop. It would be beautiful. Let's see how, I mean, don't you guys love it? Okay. Alrighty. I think that's all. <laughs> I know it was a lot, and I'm sorry for talking. I'm a talker, I, I know. And, um, but I hope you guys can about imagine what I was saying on some of the things I'm gonna be making, some of my little vineyard areas. I can't wait to get started. I'm not sure if I'm gonna get started uh, maybe the end of next week, because, you know, um, I don't wanna do it too soon because I'll get sick of it by the time Easter gets here, and I'll be ready to, you know, ready for to do something different. But I do know I want to get it out early enough for if, if any of you guys are inspired by anything I'll, you know, I'll be showing you, I would like to get it out early enough so you can see it and hope, hopefully you can go get something, um, you know, and kind of mimic, hopefully, like, you know, that'd be a huge compliment to me, uh, mimic of what I'll be doing. So I'm hoping maybe the next week or two weeks, um, I'll have like a, a series on Easter decorating because I've got like three or four places I'll be um, putting out like some um, Easter decorations. And then I may have like a little mini home, um, home, oh shoot, um, showing my home. <laughs> God, I can't think there for a second. Um, well, I'll just show my, all of my home. Well, that's like a little abbreviated area because I've been working in my dining room and my kitchen um, and a little bit of the living room. So, um, these are three little areas that are kind of like, you know, kind of the way they are. It's kind of like a open plan, I guess you would say. But um, I've got so much more planning for the kitchen. Now, that I won't get that done until probably spring because I've got to paint, cabinets, new hardware, you name it. 
but I, so I'll probably just concentrate in the dining room and living room and um, maybe in the foyer because by the way, that's my next video. I have um, done a little decorating down in my foyer and it looks so good. I really, really like it. Needed it, believe me, it really did. But uh, anyway, um, so I, I'll probably have a home tour. Duh. I'll probably have like a little mini home tour coming up after I get everything decorated after for Easter. So I can show you guys what I've been, you know, what before and after because it's a big, big difference. And um, I don't want you to think that all of a sudden I've become this decorator or nothing like that. I've always been a huge, you know, I love decorating. Uh, I mean, especially trash to treasure. I'm thrifting, going out and coming back and sanding it and painting it. And people can't believe it came from a thrift store. And I've always been that way. And I've always, most of my home was done that, like that. But I knew it was time to really bring up some, especially furniture. And if you can see my new dining room chairs, they're coming. And next, um, they're back order. They say hopefully be here in the next couple of weeks. I'm hoping to have those before the home tour. I cannot wait. I'm not gonna get a new dining room table yet because I've got a budget. So um, I may get that later on down, maybe the fall, you know, I'll get me the table I want. But for now, I want the chairs. At least I want to get the chairs. But I'm hoping, like I said, hoping to have those up before I do the home tour. Okay, I think I have I've talked to you guys enough. I hope this video isn't too long. I'll try to edit it down so, so it won't be so lengthy. And thank you guys very much for um, watching. Um, the reason I decided to do this, um, but, but I'll have like a whole video on, uh, you know, on some questions and why I decided to start showing off my home decor and why I'm in the house. Um, I've got, you would not believe the plans I've got, especially for outdoors. I can, now that there, yeah, now that's gonna be my, my main thing is outdoors, especially my back porch. And I got another drop down to another deck. Those two areas there, I've got, mm, God, I can't wait. Anyway, um, I just decided to, you know, really show and, and plus, you know, I'm, I've got a little emptiness syndrome, you know, a little bit. So I just decided to, you know, and especially I wanted to re, you know, refresh my whole house. So I thought, why not? You know, people have always said I had knack for it. So, you know, why not? But anyway, that's enough. Okay, like I said, I'm gonna have a um, Q and A uh, coming up, video coming up. I'm not sure when that'll be out. You know, hope, I'm not sure I have it before the Easter um, decorating series and or, or the home tour or before. I'm not quite sure, but um, it'll be out. You know, so you'll know everything about me and because uh, I would like to at least get you know for everybody to know what you know what type of person you know what, who I am. You know, a little bit about me at least. Um, besides, you know, I love home home decorating <laughs> and Hobby Lobby and home, home goods. <laughs> Alrighty, well, it was very nice um, demonstrating you guys what I've got coming. Um, I hope you enjoyed it, and I hope I didn't, like I said, didn't bore you guys too much or get too long-winded. Sometimes I wish somebody needs a, you know, I may have put a little timer on my camera so I <laughs> quit, quit recording. Alrighty, as always. Thank you very much for watching. I'm truly, truly grateful for you guys watching. And I hope you would subscribe to my channel. That would be, I would be honored to have you. Um, as always, from my home to yours, happy decorating. Goodbye.